Trying to show me how flexible you are? No! What's up guys? It's London. And you're on London time. Missing an L, it doesn't matter. Hmm. So, that's my cat. Right now, I'm about to head back to the bay. Oh yeah, this is a new vlog. Whoa. It's new. It's new. It's, I don't know what I'm saying. I feel like that's a common theme that I don't know what I'm saying. I just shot with Stephen Cannon um, and Cole Bennett. She came straight from London. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna call her when I'm shopping for my mom. <laughs> you you like turn it back on. <laughs> but you need to see my shine. <laughs> So that was fun. Uh, it was cool. Cole Bennett's really talented. Stephen Cannon's really talented. It was cool vision. Good song. I don't know why I'm playing with my hair like that. My cat literally scraped the frick out of me. Yeah, girl's blonde now. I'm waiting for the most amazing food of my life. Um, soul foods. If you know me, you know this is pretty much my favorite place to go. And, okay, let me just tell you what I went through. So last night when I was driving here, first of all, okay, maybe this is a common thing and I'm sounding stupid. So I was, I waited until I was on zero gas because it usually gives me like 20 miles when I'm on zero gas. And I waited a little bit longer after that because I was singing, writing my songs, whatever, forgot. So I find a gas station that's seven miles away. Like that's the closest gas station to me, seven miles away. I go to the gas station, it's closed, all the pumps are closed. And I'm like, okay, that's weird because aren't gas stations and I have a card it's not like I'm waiting for cash or something then I went to another one that was three miles away I'm freaking out this whole time like dang my car is gonna die I'm gonna be in the middle of nowhere I go to the new one that's three miles away it's closed all the pumps are closed I see someone that was there I go up to him because I'm freaking out and I need gas so I was like so why are all the pumps closed like I went to one three miles away and it was closed too and they're like yeah they're doing shift changes so you have to wait like, 45 minutes I've never heard of this. So for 45 minutes, I'm supposed to, he was like, there's one that's open 24 seven and it was 7-Eleven when I get there. Thank gosh, darn it, it was open. I know that sounds stupid, like, oh, first world pops up, guys. Ew, yeah, my knee in my house. Oh my gosh, I sat in traffic for like five hours. I don't even know if she's here. Can I stay out? I thought I just heard a snake that scared the yeah, she's home. Hi, Emma. Her mom, where she kind of pretended that she was not a big celebrity. My brother's so big now, he thinks for himself type of thing. Uh, really, Nick? <laughs> what? To a degree. To a degree. Oh, that's really pretty right now. My grandma's watching me right now. <laughs> Watch me step on a snake. Wouldn't that be awesome? Ready? Right now there's construction going on because my parents have to move back here after the fires happened in Santa Rosa. Oh. There's a butterfly and it's gonna fly at my pants. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Yeah, I just was scared about a butterfly. Just, you know what? Okay, it's because if you, if someone doing construction right now, you can for sure hear me just screaming about a butterfly and talking to myself. Anyways, um, yeah. I think there's a lot of them. Duh. Literally have goosebumps right now from these butterflies. Because you can't see, they're blending into this thing. Um, it's like imagine if a butterfly were to fly up your pants. My aunt just pulled up. First of all, didn't see me. Second of all, playing too short. That's my family, that's the Bay Area. Auntie. Hi, what were you listening to? What, how's it go? Sing it. <laughs> Don't put me off your block. What's my favorite word? <gasps> Got my brother with me. So what's up? Hello. He's got his pajama shirt on. As you can tell. We're gonna make some waffles. Yeah. We never got cooked for so we don't know how to cook. <laughs> we eat pizza for every meal. This is our first time cooking, basically. Yeah. <laughs> okay. No one can see you. One cup of this. Oh, I just took something short. Um, so oh yeah, because the buttermilk, because the, uh, the, the butter thing broke. I'm pretty sure my cat broke it. Okay, put one cup of this. Right here. Was that glass? 
Yeah. <laughs> he just, so first we almost dropped this thing and then he stepped in glass. Nice. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> well, yeah, it's glass. Oh, I'm bleeding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got glass inside of you. Uh, want to record it from the other angle? Sure, it was six of you. No. Really? No. <laughs> good thing I didn't. I, okay. We're so but. good at this. Glass still hurts. Someone left the milk out and we both had it in our cereal and it was the most horrible thing I've ever had in my life. Mm-hmm. Seems like more pancake than... <gasps> Damn. Yeah. Ugh, it does not smell nice. Did you know there was glass on the floor? It would have been nice if you said both kids just sliced their feet open. I mean, I was exaggerating. I didn't. <laughs> sliced it all the way open. Uh, yeah. I just threw things in there once I realized I did it wrong, so we'll see how this turns out. She I said go, there's 30,000 ants. <laughs> I go, where? I count three. And the grandmother said, my stove is blowing up. I go down there, a light went out. Turn this off. Wait, what'd you do? I didn't even get that. My brother and my dad won't stop dabbing. It's a problem. I'll turn this on. I already turned it on. Oh, it's not plugged in. <laughs> when my brother and I try and cook. I guess he doesn't know how to cook either. Oh, looks pretty good. What? <laughs> and you were saying? <laughs> I don't know what I was saying. You look like you're smelling your armpit, not dabbing. I know, it does look like that in the toe box. No, because you're doing it wrong. Yeah, I know, you gotta go like. No, not like that. Yeah. What are you? <laughs> Here. Thanks, well, let's test it out. Oops. Moment of truth. Ow, I just stepped in a piece of glass too. Wow. I think I did something wrong, but it tastes good. The milk? Yeah, it was bad. Boston, no, they threw it out. Boston also had it this morning. It was spoiled because someone left it out. I didn't leave it out. Oh. Yeah, he did. Yeah, blame it on me. Everything is blamed on me. <laughs> Everything. I didn't leave it. I didn't I leave know, it out. Nobody else does anything. Stuff on it. That was right. That was sound, sounds right. It sounds right. It <laughs> tastes right. Thanks. People ask me why I don't have any friends. <laughs> and then I realize that that's why. I'm gonna go through a bunch of stuff. And my parents are moving back to this house. Look what my parents have in their fridge. But the amount of devastation and chaos, complete chaos going on this past week or two when I wasn't even, I wasn't here, I can't even imagine. Just seeing it everywhere and hearing people talking about it, people not knowing where to go, realizing that they might not have a home. So many people the whole time, like, I didn't, we didn't know if we were gonna have a home. I was checking the maps during classes, I was checking to see which areas were gone, because two, three days, there was barely any containment at all, which is crazy. Everyone walking around with masks, not having proper water, but the amazing thing was to see how many people in my town came together when this happened. That was, I think, the amazing thing that came out of it, being able to see the closeness of the place that I grew up in and the community and the people and how much people came together. that the roads, like basically right next to the road, is completely burnt. That was all on fire. So people are driving. Embers are coming. No one really knew what was happening, where to go, because this happened so late at night. My parents were lucky. They got it packed. They were able to like at least have some time to take, you know, pictures, stuff like that. So many people just woke up to the fire, just having to leave with 
nothing. I have friends that couldn't find their animals. What do you think is important when it comes down to it? Yeah, I don't know. It just, a lot of my friends lost houses. Um, a lot of people in general lost houses. Huh. Ew, there's spider webs. Guys, this is about to be an adventure. Fun fact. Your girl used to be a stoner. This is my spot. Right here. What the heck has happened to it? Going back down. Let's hope that I don't die. My original plan was to leave three hours ago. But... My homework's not fun. Now I have to pack and then leave, and I'm not gonna be home till five. I would have rather been doing other things today besides homework all day. Yeah. See you on the road. Get your phone out of my face. I'm back in my place. You see the time? I see the time.